Hey you guys, so I just wanted to tell you this little achievement that I made. You're gonna think this is kind of funny, okay? Um, so what happened was is that this light went out. It was originally a fluorescent bulb. Lewis wanted to go ahead and change it. So I went ahead and I bought this light bulb from Home Depot. It is a Philips Instant Fit and it's a T8 because we have the T8 tubes. And when we put it in, it didn't work. And I know. So what happened was, is that, oh, uh, where did it go? I moved everything around. It says, I know this. Okay, so basically it says that it works only with electric start instant balances. So I went ahead and I contacted uh, an electrician and I was going to go ahead and ask him for a quote. And I thought, well, you know, I better go ahead and look up what kind of ballast we have. So I turned off the electricity, I removed the ballast cover, and I found out it was actually this one. So it is a instant start ballast. This was the exact ballast that we have. And I thought to myself, why the hell isn't it working? Is it that the ballast isn't bad? Or is it because the light bulb wasn't put in well? So, I went on my ladder again, shimmied out the light bulb, checked it, put it back, readjusted it, it was kind of dim, and then I thought, well, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and take out the other light bulb which we had. I put it in, I jiggled, 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 and it was still dim, and I thought, well, let me see if I can switch it the other side, see, because one side says Phillips and the other side so one end says Philip, so I thought, okay, well, let me try and reverse it. So I went ahead and reversed it, and it works! The light works! I'm so happy! So we went ahead and we avoided an electrician, and I feel very, very proud. And the moment that this ballast needs replacing, for sure, I'm going to call it electrician. But when it comes to replacing the light bulb and shimming it out, well... Look, I hate to say it, well, we had the light bulbs here for about a month <laughs> and we thought we needed an electrician, but in actuality, all we need to do is shimmy the light bulbs in and put the other one in. So it works. I'm going to go ahead and put the cover on and he will have a working light without any flickering. I'm so happy. Yeah, I am really, really happy and proud of this and I have to go ahead and clean up everything because I... I went ahead and I thought, well, this is going to be my task for the day. I called the electrician up, but I avoided that. So, yeah. Next time, if you guys have a light bulb like this and it doesn't seem like it works and the ballast seems to be the right one, just shimmy the light bulb. I know. I, I've never replaced this in my life, so I wasn't. I thought it was just you pop it in like a regular light bulb and it works instantly, but I had to shimmy, shimmy, and it worked. No, Oriole's in the store today. He's, he's in the store, but... I'm sure he sent me his uh, well wishes. No, I didn't. I didn't uh, replace the ballast. I don't trust myself with replacing the ballast. Although I did do some research how to go ahead and convert it. You have to go ahead and cut the wires and then remove it and then crimp it in with this little um, uh, this little piece. But I think I'm going to probably leave a professional to it just in case. Okay, well, see ya. Just wanted to show you. Bye-bye.